we've got a nice start to our Tuesday morning. Things are going to get a little bumpy here by midweek. Uh, early on, though, some mid to upper 40s as your kiddos are stepping out the door. 75 by the time they get home between about 2 and 3 o'clock. And we're going to hit highs right around 80 degrees here this afternoon. Uh, there will be a chance for a few storms tonight. We had quite a bit of a light show. I had a little rain in my neighborhood yesterday, and tonight you could again see a few more of those storms, mainly east of I-25. Much stronger storms closer to Denver expected tomorrow, and then it's going to be cooler by Thursday. Those temps are going to drop dramatically here uh, through the end of the week. You can see what's left of these storms as they now move out and in, into Nebraska. A little bit of lightning there through early morning near Sterling and uh, just east of Akron, but drier conditions here in town and a lot of sunshine for that early morning drive. We're in the mid to upper 40s right now. Winds are fairly calm. You're going to find sunshine as you step out the door and take a look at Futurecast, how fast it's going to warm up today. We should see some low 60s here by about 1030 this morning and then getting closer to 70 by lunchtime. A few building clouds here this afternoon, an isolated storm or two, and then overnight tonight we'll see potentially a few more of those out east. Otherwise, skies then overnight tonight will be partly cloudy. Early tomorrow morning, we're waking up to again some 40s and 50s to kick off our Wednesday. And then take a look at the timing of tomorrow's storms. It's going to be still pretty quiet through mid morning, and then we'll likely see by early afternoon, 2 to about 3 o'clock, those storms developing. The risk is going to be for some larger hail, damaging winds, potentially even some tornadoes, and temps are going to drop too through the afternoon. We'll see more scattered pockets of some even heavier rain overnight Wednesday into Thursday. Some of that mixing in with snow up and through the mountains above about 10,000 feet. So expecting wet roads early Thursday morning and another round of some scattered storms and showers. So it's going to be a little unsettled here, especially Wednesday and Thursday. Here's that risk of severe weather for tomorrow afternoon. Covers all of eastern Colorado again for some of those stronger storms. So we're likely going to have severe thunderstorm warnings, potentially even tornado warnings rolling at the bottom of the screen. We'll keep you up to date as everything develops tomorrow. Mid to upper 70s today, low 70s by early afternoon tomorrow, and then it's going to get quite a bit cooler as those showers roll through. In fact, you could see about a 10 to 15 degree cool down within just a few minutes when you get the rain rolling through. Scattered storm showers, cooler weather on Thursday. The risk of severe weather is going to be a lot lower Thursday. It's going to shift east of Colorado into Nebraska and Kansas. And then on Friday, we'll see some low 60s. Looking pretty good for the weekend, although a chance for some afternoon showers mm -hmm. and some low to mid 60s, Jason, Saturday and Sunday.